All right, so today we are looking at a, a naked baby and letting Saray give us information on the Mexico launch, how she has been successful with signing distributors in Mexico now, and how you can do the same thing, especially if you're bilingual. This is going to be so huge for your business. So I'm going to mute myself. Take it away. Thank you. <laughs> All right, guys. So we just recently found out that we were going to be opening in Mexico and the Philippines, which is great news. We probably like wondering what we're supposed to be doing, especially because Mexico is going to be launching very, very soon. I've heard rumors that it should be sometime in April. I'm not sure everything as far as like the exact date, but that is the rumor that is circulating. So it is coming fairly, fairly quickly. So the way that I've been doing it as far as enrolling distributors has been um, messaging. I had already, um, since I'm bilingual, I had already added a lot of people who spoke Spanish. So through Instagram, when I came across these people that spoke Spanish and were in Mexico and were interested in buying the product or they wanted to join the company and they were in Mexico, I had already created a folder in my Instagram under collections. You have this option in your collections folder. Um, and basically I have one for every Spanish speaking country because I come across a lot of different people that are not in, in the U.S., so I've added people there. And then now that I know that we're opening in Mexico, I have been messaging them. But I'm also, doing, also at, um, finding people that are just brand new because I've cold messaged them recently. And I just find out that they're in Mexico because I am actively looking for people in Mexico now. So what I've been doing is messaging them and basically asking them a simple question, asking them if they would like to know more information about the business or the products. And then they message me and tell me that they would love to find out more information. I personally went into the places in Mexico. I looked up cities in Mexico. My husband is half Mexican. So I looked up the cities where his family was from. Um, I don't really, I mean, you could look at the tourist areas, but I feel like that is just going to be very common for distributors to just look up Cancun, Acapulco and stuff like that. So that's just going to be very common. So what I did was I found like actual places that, people might not not be researching. So um, this gives me an advantage to find people that are bloggers um, because believe it or not, there is a ton of bloggers in Mexico. So I have been looking more towards those profiles because of the fact that I don't really have to teach them that much about social media because they already know about social media. They know about posting pretty pictures. They know about um, the concept of the, of the profile looking pretty. And I want to find these people who have um, a lot of um, followers, but that's just for me. That's just the advantage that I want. Um, so I've been sending them this message. Let me post it in the chat so that you guys can have an idea. Um, this is a Spanish message. So if you want an English version, I will um, share it with you. So this is a message that I've been sending in Spanish. Um, I'll translate it. Basically, it's saying like, hey, I'm looking to expand my business and share the products with people. And maybe you know of maybe you're interested or if you know someone who would be interested in making also making extra money from your phone. I don't know if you have a couple minutes to talk about the products with me or to talk about the business with me. I send them this message. They tell me what they want, if they want more information about the products or the business, if they want more information about the products, then I just set them aside. Um, and then I talk to them and tell them what products are going to be available in Mexico. So right now, as of right now, the only products that are going to be available in Mexico is going to be the wraps, the facials, and um, the wraps, the facials, and the body wraps. Yeah, no, wraps, facials, and the fab wrap. There's a third product. I can't remember it right now. So there's only three products that are, that are going to be available there. Um, but people, oh, defining job. Thank you, Macy. So that's all that's going to be available. But the people who um, join your team in Mexico are going to be available to sell to other people outside of Mexico. So they are going to need to know about the product because they're going to, they're going to be able to sell it. Um, even though they're a distributor in Mexico, they're going to be able to sell to people in the U.S. or families in the U.S. Um, and vice versa. So um, I have already started. Um, yeah. Give me one second. I 
think I should be able to. Actually, I can't. Tara would have to. Um, when Tara comes back, I'll tell her to mute. Let me see if I can. Oh, I think your microphone is on. No, you're good. You're good. Okay, so um, people who have who want to join your your team that are in Mexico or the Philippines, you're going to send them your website. So my website is my first and my last name dot it works.com. But for them to sign up, you're going to send them to your website and then it's going to be forward, forward slash expansion. And when you send them, let me see if I can share. Cause I did here we go. Give me one second. I'm going to remind you guys get Okay. Is it sharing my screen or are you guys see it still seeing my face? Your face. Um, oh, I gotta start the broadcast. Duh. Okay. Is it still sharing my okay? Now I'm sharing my screen. Okay, so you guys can see my screen, right? Yes. Just wanna make sure. Okay, perfect. Thank you. Okay, so I already put the website on so that you guys could see what it looks like. Um, so it's going to be your, so mine is com forward slash forward slash forward slash expansion. And it's going to take them to this website. And it says 10 months, 10 markets, because we are going to be expanding eventually. And they, this, this is exactly where they're going to be able to sign up on your team. They are reserving a spot, which is what I tell them when I'm messaging them. So I send them that initial message that I shared in the chat. And then when they tell me that they want more information about the business, I tell them that I have a great opportunity for them, that they can reserve their spot on my team, no commitment. They don't have to put any money down. The business itself, they're not going to have to have any type of inventory whatsoever. And that is something that's a turn on for them because from what I the information that I've obtained from the distributors that I've enrolled right now, they mentioned that um, a lot of companies down there with direct sales, you have to have inventory. So with, with this one, I tell them that they don't have to have inventory. They can select where they're from, where they're reserving their spot. They put their information, their phone number, and then basically they even show up on your e-suite. So after they've already subscribed to your e-suite, this is a picture that's going to come up. This is what they're going to receive. It's going to say account was created. They're going to get an account ID number, and then they're going to get their own personal website. So this distributor, it says Lara Estrada, and then it has the forward slash expansion. And that website is what they're going to share with everybody who is interested in joining the company. Um, they get their own link. Now, all these people are going to show up on your e-suite, and it's going to look really crazy. So if you're personally enrolling distributors you yourself you're the only one that can move these distributors below another distributor but your distributors let's say for example this girl laura she enrolled as a distributor she cannot have access to e-suite at this point so everybody she's enroll enrolling whether she enrolls her sister her aunt everybody every, every single family member she can't access e-suite so it's just going to be a sh like all of them are just going to be below her this is how their profile shows up in your e-suite um, it's going to show up like they are a distributor. It's going to have their email. Obviously they're on commission hold, no auto ships, no orders, no nothing just has their account number. And that's it. I just, I also screenshotted another distributor that I have just so you guys had an idea. Once we've actually, um, open up in Mexico, then we are going to be able to then physically move these distributors underneath another and create your actual chart but for now they're just showing up in your e-suite under reports so if you're already enrolling am i frozen am i frozen okay no okay um you're gonna be able to see them so i i just wanted to give you that warning make sure that you guys are keeping a very close tab on it who you're enrolling in mexico because they show up like a, a distributor and you don't want to accidentally like lose them in the process in your tree viewer um, or confuse that you have charted a promotion when you really haven't because that has already happened to us and we thought that there was an extra distributor. We didn't know who they were um, because they show up and everything. Like you can move them. They show up in your personally enrolled 
team report. So it's, you just want to make sure you have it documented. So once I have enrolled a distributor in Mexico, what I do is I um, tell them to add me on Facebook right away. I create a chat and I already have a chat that started for girls in Mexico. I'm teaching them what the three products that we have available are right now. I'm teaching them what the company is about and the fact that they don't have to have inventory. I'm already send, giving them a message to send to their family and friends to find out more if they want to join the company um, or to let them know about the opportunity. And now that the time is getting closer, um, I'm keeping tabs with them because of, because they can't really do much. Um, I don't want them to get discouraged yet because they haven't really, um, they're not really in the company yet. So I have just, and some of them, some people have asked me like, okay, what do I say about pricing? So the way I talk about pricing is I just flat out tell them, look, in the, here in the U S it's $99. It's probably going to be the same currency around toward, like maybe, um, around the same currency of whatever it is in pesos down there. Um, but don't even worry about that right now because of the fact that the company is always throwing out different promotions right now we have a $20 deal. So who knows, maybe when we launch in Mexico, it could be less, but right now what I want you to focus on is building your team, saving up the money. If you want until the company opens, you have the opportunity to start from now to save your money for when it launches. You already have a team that's stacked. Look, this is your chart. You're already charted for Ruby. This is the average that you're going to be making with the people that you have currently right now. And it gets them excited. Um, I have seen, we have a couple Spanish pages. There's one that's called It Works Sin Fronteras that if you are not added on there, make sure you add yourself. Um, that That is the It Works Spanish, Spanish page. It's complete, it's ran by Margarita Vargas and some people in corporate. Um, some of the top Spanish leaders, they're already adding their potentials from Mexico to this page. So it's already, um, there's a lot of information that has been translated into Spanish. So if you have potentials, um, even as of right now, everything on there is just in Spanish. So for people who are bilingual, or even if you're trying to find customers who, um, who need information in Spanish, you can find this in your e-suite, everything, all the products, everything about the company, most of it has already been translated in Spanish. So you have access to it. Um, and just basically, you want to start building this team. If you have anybody who's bilingual here in the U.S., you want to prepare them for this launch because once we go live, there are people who are already have like diamond charts full of distributors and potentials that they have down there. So this is like ridiculous. Everybody's like, you want to definitely try to build your team as quickly as possible. Um, so that's basically what I do. That 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 chat that I or that example that I sent you guys. Um, and then everything else that I do is basically voice message. Um, I just explaining and preparing them. If they have questions, if they have doubts or anything, I just try to orientate them as much as I can now. Um, the only downfall, which is why I say that you have to make sure you're keeping tabs, tabs with these distributors, is that when you're sharing the link with them, they don't have access or they don't get a confirmation if they've um, enrolled someone. So you just have to keep communication with them to let them know, yes, this person went through, this person did enroll. So just so that they know, so that they're not like harassing the person. Um, and they've enrolled this whole time. So the same concept is the same for the Philippines. So they can reserve their spot over there. I just don't know very much about what's going on in the Philippines. It's just what's going on in Mexico. Um, a lot of the Spanish leaders are just preparing a lot of videos. There's a lot of material that's coming out so that people can post. There's a kind of like a similar post for customers, but in Spanish that people are already preparing some of those things for like stories and everything. Um, uh, Team Hooper has a Tuesday night call that is every Tuesday night, and it's at, I believe it's at 8 o'clock at night. It's ran by Tanya Morelos. She's the one that's in charge of interviewing basically Spanish leaders. Tomorrow is going to be most likely Jessica Diaz. I'm going to be interviewed next Tuesday. And this is just, if you have your potentials, this is where you want to add them to this call. Um, your goal is to invite three Spanish-speaking or three bilingual Everything is just in Spanish and we are being interviewed. We're going over what's going to happen in Mexico, what the company is about. Um, last week, they interviewed my friend Maria. 
And she basically t- spoke about her story, why the company was good to her up to this point. This girl is a single mom, mama four, and she's a diamond leader. Well, four, you can use my third finger. Um, and she is a diamond leader. So she is killing it too. So basically we are telling our stories or interviewing us so that we, same thing that we do opportunity calls, just to have them ask us questions, figure out what the company's about because they don't know what it works is about. They have no idea. Um, so they, it's a great way to get these potentials in there. Um, and it, I believe the information is located in the dash to diamonds page, but Jade Hooper also has another Spanish group that's called team Mexico, um, which you can get your, when, once they've enrolled, they can, all the information is in, in that page. So I know it's like, it probably might seem like a lot of information, but at this point, what you guys want to focus on is building your team. So adding people that are in Mexico or people who are here in the U.S. that have family in Mexico, bilingual. So you can post it on your stories. I'm looking for bilingual girls that want to make money from their phone. And then that way you have an in. You can, you can um, train your DT here in the U.S. who is bilingual teach them everything they need to know because it's only $20 to enroll. And then she can start building her team in Mexico because she's bilingual. So you teach her how to be able to build her team over there as well. And then that way you don't have to do it all on your own, especially if you don't know Spanish. So you already have a girl who speaks Spanish on your team and can just pretty much take care of that end and you just keep running with it. So make sure you're stacking bilinguals together if possible. That way you can all work as a team um, and trainings and just, kind of figure out what's the best way to train. Um, Cause even though, again, there's only three products in Mexico, they still have to know everything because they have access to the U S market too. So, um, but it's, it's a great way to uh, Cami at the span and at conference said that she went black diamond with just the wrap. So it's not a downfall that we only have three products. It's actually something very positive that we only have three products. So we just have to talk about it. Like it is the, best thing in the world because it is we're the only company with this type of formula with further wraps and everything so we just have to basically show them with our results um and believe in the product so that they understand what it does because they don't know what it does they've never seen it before so um do you guys have any questions as far as this launch and i shared that one script but basically let me see if i can find my conversation with because I think it was voice message. Um, I'm going to send just screenshots of some of the training information that I've done with some of the girls in Mexico. Um, I have a chat for all of them. As they start adding their new distributors, then they just add them into the group. But I also... Um, well, it's not letting me open my messenger. Okay, here it is. I literally just sent them the product info for the three products that are available just so that they can start talking about it because they can get potentials in, in Mexico. They can get their people lined up. Um, where is it? Hmm. Okay, so this is also going to be in Spanish, but you guys can, um, this is explaining basically a couple of training information for them. I don't know, Jordan. I don't know if it's the same three products. The only reason why I know it's those three products in Mexico. Okay, so this is just a little explanation about the products that are going to be there in Mexico, um, explaining the compensation plan just a little bit as far as how their pay is going to be monthly and how they transfer it to an app. Um, A little birdie told me that the only thing we're waiting for is just um, a certain permission. That's that's the only thing we were waiting for at this point. but yeah, so it's it's exciting. So you guys, if you guys have any potentials, definitely get started on getting them signed up, holding a spot. And I make it sound like it's something super exclusive. I tell them, because right now it's free. They can just sign up. They just give the information and that's it. They just go into the website and hold their spot. So I make it sound like it's such a 
because it is, it's a great opportunity. Nobody knows about it. They're the first people there. Um, in Spanish, they've been calling it like the pioneers because they go in and it's like nobody knows about it at all. So they're going to be able to get their team stacked. And, and it's just, I just tell them, it's, you want to reserve your spot. You want to know about this company. This company has given like, and I tell them about my experience and everything. So um, it's just a great opportunity right now. Did anybody have any questions? Again, I think I already asked, but I don't know if anybody wanted to unmute themselves or. I just wanted to reiterate the point that the reason why we didn't just have this training for the Spanish speaking team is the fact that you have the ability to sign yeah. is bilingual and this gives you the step-by-step -step instructions to help them be successful, which helps you be successful. So don't allow your inability to speak Spanish hold you back from it because you start building a really successful Spanish speaking team. And when you have a leader that you're building from the very beginning, teaching them how to do this, their team's going to start popping off like crazy because I can't even tell you how many times people in Mexico or Spanish speaking countries have said, please tell me when you're in my country, we need help here, please. I need this for my family. So you can be able to help that person by getting someone on your team. And you need to be very, very confident about speaking about this opportunity in Mexico because it's not even just in Mexico. There are so many Spanish speaking people here in the United States that cannot sign up because they technically are illegal um, immigrants here. So once we launch in Mexico, the people in the United States who have hookups in Mexico and in the United States are going to be able to sign up and they're bilingual. So this is huge. This is, they, Spanish communities want to help their families so bad. That's why a lot of them are here. So they can make money and send it back home to their family. So this is a way that they can get their family out of their situation while they're here and their family can start building it from their end as well. So please take this seriously. This is such an amazing opportunity for you and the coming of your team. So thank you, Theray. So You're welcome. So that you made it just so simple you broke it down and I got it does anyone else need more clarification on anything let me go through and see if anyone's got faces no awesome that that just goes to show how good you are at explaining things <laughs> thank you <laughs> People are like, I still don't get it. And I'm like, okay, let me, let me try to work on my teaching skills. <laughs> Look at the handsome boy. Hi, baby. My baby's all mad. All right, well, thank you so much. The, the um, done Zoom is starting in like two minutes. So perfect timing. Thank you so much. Can everyone say thank you to Saray for taking time with no husband and two babies tonight? <laughs> I know. Thank you. You're welcome, love. See ya. Gracias. There we go. Thank you. Thank you. Bye. Bye. Thanks, guys. Thanks, Adios. everyone. <laughs>